Here let us see a very interesting question from the chapter mathematical induction. Here question is prove by the principle of mathematical induction for all n belonging to the set of natural number. Uh, mathematical statement given is a plus a r plus a r square plus up to a r to the power n minus 1 is equal to a r to the power n minus 1 divided by r minus 1 where r is not equal to 1. Otherwise, this will be 1 minus 1 0 which will not be defined. That is why the condition is provided r is not equal to 1. And when you try to recall, this is a formula which we have discussed in the chapter of geometric progression. This is the formula for sum of n first n terms of geometric progression. Now, we will prove it here, we will establish it here. Okay? So, let us see the solution. Here the statement which is denoted by P n, mathematical statement is denoted by P n, which is here A plus A r plus A r square plus A r to the power n minus 1, this is equal to A r to the power n minus 1 divided by r minus 1 let us call it relation number 1. Okay. First step, we have to show that this statement P n is true for n is equal to 1. That will be our first step. Second step, we will put n is equal to k, where k is a positive integer. Generally, we put n is equal to r, but there is r already here. So, it will be confused. That is why we will take n is equal to k and uh, that will be second step. So, p k is true that we will assume second step. And third step, we have to show that p k plus 1 is true. Means, whenever we will put n is equal to k plus 1 here in this relation number 1 and at that moment, we have to prove that this statement is true. So, by doing these three statements, our process will be complete and we will come to the conclusion that given statement is true for n is equal to all natural numbers. Okay? So, first step we have to show that p 1 is true. Okay? So, here we will put n is equal to 1, putting n is equal to 1 in relation number 1. We will get since here total number of terms is n and if we are putting n is equal to 1, then you have to take only one term, first term here. So, first term will be here a and right hand side is, we will put n is equal to 1 here. So, right hand side is a into r to the power 1 minus 1 divided by r minus 1. So, this will be cancel out here or we are getting a is equal to a that is LHS is equal to RHS. So, we are coming to the conclusion that therefore, P 1 is true LHS is equal to RHS shows that P 1 is true. Now, second step we will assume that assuming that P k is true. Means, whenever we will put n is equal to k, we are assuming that this relation is true. So, therefore, putting n is equal to k in relation number 1, we will get p k is a plus a r plus a r square a r to the power k minus 1 is equal to a r to the power k minus 1 divided by r minus 1. This is relation number 2. We are assuming that this is true. And third and last step is to show that p k plus 1 is true. So, here putting n is equal to k plus 1 in relation number 1. We will be getting here 
we get from relation number 1 a plus a r plus a r square plus a r to the power k minus 1 minus 1 will be here minus 1 plus last term is we are putting n is equal to k plus 1. So, k plus 1 minus 1. So, a r to the power k plus 1 minus 1 ok and right hand side will be a into r to the power k plus 1 minus 1 divided by r minus 1. So, we have to establish it, we have to show that this is true means we have to show that LHS is equal to RHS. So, now let us start with the left hand side ok. So, left hand side is A plus A R plus A R square A R to the power k minus 1 plus A R to the power this is k A R to the power k plus 1 minus 1 will be cancel out and you see relation number 2 up to this much expression in place of this much you can write this one hmm, by relation number 2. So, we will get this much is equal to a into r to the power k minus 1 divided by r minus 1 correct and last term is this much a r to the power k plus a r to the power k. Now, this is equal to let us take LCM, he will multiply this with a here. So, this is a r to the power k minus a plus after taking LCM, LCM will be here r minus 1 will multiply r minus 1 with a r to the power k. So, this is a r to the power k plus 1 minus a r to the power k. Now, you see here plus a r to the power k and minus a r to the power k will be cancel out. So, this is equal to here in numerator a will be common. So, a is common here. So, r to the power k plus 1 minus 1 divided by r minus 1. So, you see this is uh, this right hand side which we had to prove here and we are getting this result. So, therefore, here we are getting LHS is equal to RHS that is P R K plus 1 sorry P K plus 1 is true. So, all these three steps are over we have completed it and at the last we have to write one line statement that Therefore, this given statement P n is true for all n by principle of mathematical induction, principle of mathematical induction. So, proved we are getting the result. So, solution is very interesting, very simple. Hope you have understood it very well. So, we will see some more problems in other videos to come. Thank you very much for watching this video. Keep enjoying mathematics. Thank you.